Hi friends, it's Drayton. Welcome to my world. About a year ago, I had a unique opportunity to attend the 129th annual Tournament of Roses. Here's a ticket from the game. It was the Oklahoma Sooners and the Georgia Bulldogs. And I didn't just get to go to the game, I got to go to the game as a special guest, a VIP. Thanks to my friend Diana, we had an awesome time. And it wasn't just the game and the parade, we had some off the beaten path adventures to show you. And I can't wait for you to see these videos. So this week is all about sunny Southern California. I'll catch up with you at the end of the series. Thanks for watching. I'll see you soon. Today in sunny California, as a part of some of the Rose Bowl festivities that I'm going to, I'm going to be here at this Equifest. It's a horse event. Lots of horse stuff going on. It's like a bunch of cowboy stuff and there's booths all around. Let me show you around here. If you're an OU or Georgia fan, you can buy some luggage here. Along with all kinds of other stuff. Oils, hats, jewelry. Still, we are the cavalry. In fact, it says over there on the facts, it was the first kite mobile. I wonder if they called it a kite wagon. No, it doesn't say it was the first kite wagon. But, but it might have been. This is what the inside of a stagecoach looks like. And indeed, she did when she got a book Ramon in 1884. It was wildly popular and has never gone out of print. Check it out, there's a. Who's set up of an old camp here, an army camp? I think, could you guys live in one of these tents? Would you live in one of these? Yeah. Yeah. Wagon, this army wagon. Here's the back side of the wagon. This is a pretty cool compartment set up. I could use one of these for the van. I'm gonna build one of those. Remember how he bangs? How he bangs his hook? Because he wants a carrot. Thank you. It's gonna be so hot. Why are you here? The 
San Antonio Winery in LA. It's the oldest winery in LA. Got a very great tour earlier. Got to meet Gary Sinise, as you might know from Forrest Gump and some other movies. And he's also the um, Grand Marshal of the Rose Bowl Parade, which we're going to be showing you some very cool footage from. So this is very cool. Very cool. Hi, everybody. Welcome. Well, uh, anybody from Chicago in here? What? Originally. Don't Originally live from there Chicago. Now. Not, not right now. <laughs> it's cold there now. Yeah. <laughs> Who's from the East Coast where it's cold? Yeah, welcome to California. <laughs> I, I remember. Uh, what? What? Georgia. That doesn't even count. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> no, I'm talking about cold. 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 When I'm yeah, yeah, Minneapolis. What? We're from Minneapolis. Okay, you know what I'm from. <laughs> I'm, I'm from yep. Chicago, so I grew up here. And I remember being in Chicago watching this parade. Uh, growing up as a kid, watching this parade and being so jealous of everybody who lived in Pasadena. <laughs> because uh, everybody's had, got their t-shirts and shorts and blue sky and sun and everything. And it was cold in Chicago. Never in a million years did I think I'd be the Grand Marshal of the Rose Parade, but uh, thank you, Lance, for that. I'm uh, very grateful. Uh, it's, a, it's a humbling honor to be among the distinguished list of, of Grand Marshals that have been uh, participants in this parade over the 129 years that it's been going on. Um, you're all friends of Lance's? <laughs> you you are now well so am I and I and I'm and I'm grateful I am I, I I really am very touched and humbled to be a part of it and to be a part of this particular theme making a difference uh, I uh, and to be acknowledged for actually trying to do that is is is, is a, a great reward I I have tried to do that with regard to our, our veterans and our military community and our wounded and our Gold Star families and the initiatives that I have through my foundation, the Gary Sinise Foundation, and all the many years that I've been at that. Um, shining a light on me a little bit as Grand Marshal can, you know, to me it's going to shine a light on the people that I'm trying to make a difference for, and that's the men and women who serve our country. I just got back from Afghanistan and Iraq just last week. I was there. Uh, spirits were high. Uh, our folks are, are, are doing well, although they're doing dangerous and difficult things over there in both places. And we don't hear about it all the time. So if somebody like me, who's got a little spotlight and a, and a bit of the public eye, can go interact with them, see what they do, uh, be a, a good advocate for them, and kind of talk about what they're doing, uh, for us, and that's the way that I feel that I can make a difference in, in their lives. Uh, it's been a great privilege to be able to do that, and uh, certainly a great privilege to be a part of the, of the Rose Parade. Thank you for, uh, for, for being here. Welcome. Have a wonderful day. Enjoy your time with us. Have a wonderful stay. If there's anything we can do, I know Gary and his committee will take great care of you. So thank you. Safe travels home. Happy New Year. Thank you. Thank you. Happy New Year. back in the post parade and then you're welcome so you should have two of those so this is a parade and there should be two I mean you can go one two one two okay, and then you go to the tailgate after that then okay. you go to the game after that there are two there Let's get back on this bus take me back to the hotel okay guys I just got back from a little dinner here at the winery and this is the VIP bag let's see what's in the VIP bag for the Rose Bowl. Well, it looks like a pretty large, I don't know what this is, coffee table, well, it's a, it looks like a coffee table book. It's 
Got some some other stuff. Got a got a candy bar that's a hundred percent real. Got a thermos here. Some more candy bars. A brace. Oh, two two of these. Two of these Ohio State colors, which I like a lot, which are not playing in this game. And a new pin for the kite van. Look at that. Making a difference. Cool. The Hermanos Pueblo is trying to promote respect and friendship.